triangles are everywhere. You see them on bridges, on the towers for power lines, they're on houses, they're everywhere you look. Now you can classify or group triangles by the kind of angles that they have. There's right, obtuse, and acute triangles. Right triangles have one right angle because all the angles in a triangle add up to 180 degrees so there is only space for one. So they have one right angle. Here's a bike. Its frame is made out of triangles. Here is a right triangle. The right angle is indicated with a square. Here's another right triangle. It's a right triangle because it has a right angle. Obtuse triangles have one obtuse angle. An obtuse angle is more than 90 degrees. This grain elevator has an example of an obtuse triangle. You can see that the bottom angle in the triangle is obtuse. On the bottom of this billboard, the framing that holds it up also shows an example of an obtuse triangle. Acute triangles have only acute angles. So it doesn't matter if a triangle has two acute angles, it has to have all acute angles to be an acute triangle. These power poles have some examples of acute triangles. All the angles are acute, there's no obtuse or right angles on them. This building also has an example of an acute triangle. You don't only have to classify triangles by their angles, but you can also classify them by their sides. Equilateral triangles have three equal sides, and the best way to remember this is it looks like the word equal at the beginning of equilateral, and if you play football, a lateral is a football thrown to the side, not forward. So equilateral means equal-sided. Yield signs, they're equilateral, all three sides are the same, or you can even say all three sides are congruent, congruent means equal. You can see that the framing of this bridge also uses equilateral triangles. The sides are all the same on these triangles. One neat thing about equilateral triangles is not only the sides that are all equal, but also all three angles will be equal. Isosceles triangles have two equal sides. This building has an isosceles triangle above the main door. It has two equal sides. This parking meter actually has two examples of isosceles triangles. Not only do isosceles triangles have two equal sides, but they will also have two equal base angles. Here's one more example of an isosceles triangle. Scalene triangles have no equal sides. No sides are the same. Here's an example of a scalene triangle. No sides are the same. Here's another example of a scalene triangle. 